Hey guys, thank you for joining me for part two. I just want to give you a heads up. There were some recording issues with this episode. I still continue on. You're going to notice that I did catch on to uh, the recording being terrible, but uh, I, I'm a perfectionist and I just want to address this before this episode starts. So I hope you guys enjoy this and um, trust me, I'll, I'll get this squared out before part three. Hey guys, welcome back to Oh Snap It's Yan, it's me Yan, and uh, this is the part two of uh, Hogwarts Legacy. Um, the first one was kind of like a, a real long intro. I wasn't really expecting for that video to be too long. Um, and again, the only reason why I recorded it is because I was trying to set up all the video settings and everything for it. And then they gave me a letter from Hogwarts. I'm like, oh wow, uh, I don't want to miss out on this experience. So I decided to go ahead and record it. Um, I actually just got out of work. It's about 7 o'clock in the morning right now. Oh, my goodness. My, my shift is crazy. But uh, to recap, we actually, uh, you know, was able to chill out with Professor Fig. We figured out that our character can see ancient magic. And that's what I'm assuming. That he can see ancient magic. And we are a fifth-year student at Hogwarts. We just got admitted. We pick Hufflepuff because, you know, that's my color that's my jam and uh right now this is gonna be my first uh hogwarts um movement i guess you could say you know i, I haven't like explored the, the the school yet so um i'm gonna look around i'm not trying to keep the series too long uh keep in mind guys i'm very new to like recording and not new but more or less working on a bunch of new stuff when it comes to youtube um content creating and um i'm not a pro like everybody else i'm still trying to figure stuff out i can eat everything and um you know you're gonna see a lot of changes throughout the videos as this series going but this is a series that i don't want to stop doing i'm gonna keep rocking on as i go on oh what's this um but so far we have two spells i think three because it's like basic attack but we uh in, in key binding one is lumos lumos yes and Revelio. Revelio, there you go. I couldn't remember what it was. Oh, it does reveal some stuff. So this is the we're in the Hufflepuff common room right now. And I'm just gonna walk around. I get to find your common room. That's my common room over there. So that was my room apparently. I'm not gonna try to get too sidetracked and in, in um explore too much, but what is this? How does this work? How do how do I interact with this? But yeah, um, when when it comes to like dead air or dead air, well, that uh, oh. well, I'm I'm tired right now. When it comes to dead time in between missions, I'm not going to uh, have, force you guys to watch it. I'll, I'll I'll probably transition into it as much as I could. But we'll see. Okay, so we're going to common room. I think this is. I suppose some introductions are in order. Oh, this is where I get to meet some of my classmates, my Hufflepuff fam. Uh, Lenora Everly. What's up? Oh, hello. She's awfully regal, isn't she? Is that your owl? I don't know who she is. Likely one of the Hufflepuffs around here. Owls choose their own company anyway. Wait, you're the new fifth year. Quite the dramatic entrance you made. Can't imagine wanting to call attention to yourself, especially since everyone will be watching to see how much you already know. What? Okay. Um, I don't. I, I do have a lot to catch up on. I'm not worried. Uh, I do have a lot to catch up on. Let's say, just say that. I am a bit concerned. Cause I don't know what I have a lot going of catching up to do. Indeed, four years of schoolwork is a bit. Being that far behind, I'd feel so inadequate. Of course. Presumably, as a hard-working Hufflepuff, you'll prove yourself in no time. I'm hard-working too, as you might suspect. But sometimes I think I should have been a Ravenclaw. I've rather a searing wit. <laughs> At least people have always told me so. I'm Lenora, by the way. Lenora Everly. Everly. Well, mustn't keep you. You've such a lot to do. Uh, you think you should have should have been a Ravenclaw? Actually, I want to know why she thinks she should have been a Ravenclaw. Do you really think you should have been in Ravenclaw? Well, my brothers were. They both work in the ministry now. 
I suppose you could say that wit runs in the family. My aunt was a Gryffindor, though, and I've always had plenty in common with her. Determination, valor, daring. The old sorting hat was spoiled for choice with me. All right, well, it's nice to meet you, Lenora. It was nice meeting you, Lenora. Of course, adieu. Adieu to you. Well, that was nice. Let's see what else we got going on here. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh. <laughs> I was like, is that a glitch or did that? Okay, I have no idea what the hell just happened. Arthur's got you. Maybe you don't that was a glitch. Frightened, little cat. All right, let's talk to Arthur Plumley. Uh, I can't quite reach. Uh, come on, he went that way. Hope they can catch him. Big castle for a student to get lost in, let alone a cat. <laughs> I'm sure you'll find your way, all right. I mean, it can be a bit overwhelming at first. I still get lost sometimes. <laughs> Welcome to Hufflepuff, by the way. Really glad to have you in our house. I'm Arthur. Thank you. Nice to meet you. Was that your cat? No, one of the first years, I think. Don't have any pets of my own, unfortunately. My mother doesn't think too highly of them, especially magical ones. Um, I love animals. Shame. I think magical beasts are incredible, yes. I'm sorry to hear that. I think magical beasts are rather incredible. Best thing about coming to Hogwarts. Nifflers, Glumbumbles, Bowtruckles. I thought they were only pictures in books before. Well, Dad did bring home a puff scheme once. Mum was furious. <laughs> anyway, I better go make sure the first years caught that cat. Don't want them to be late on their first day. Uh, have you ever had a pet? Have you ever had a pet, Arthur? No. My mother's a muggle, and as soon as the puff scheme that my dad brought home stuck its tongue up her nose, it went right back to the shop. <laughs> All right, good luck, Arthur. Nice meeting you, Arthur, and good luck finding that cat. Thank you. Try not to get lost in the castle yourself. I'm already lost in the common room. Introduce yourself to Adelaide. I think I'm saying her name right. Adelaide Oaksy. Oh, oh, Uncle, oh, this doesn't oh. sound like you. Something's wrong. Oh, hello there. You're the new Hufflepuff, yes? I'm Adelaide. Adelaide. Pleasure to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Is everything all right? Oh, yes. I'm just a bit distracted. Letter from my uncle. So tell me, I've been hearing all sorts of rumors. Were you really nearly gobbled up by a dragon? Facts. That one is true. Not the typical start to a new school. That's dreadful. Well, I'm glad you made it here alive. Well, anyway, I imagine you have lots to do. I hope you have a wonderful first day. Oh, is your uncle all right? Are you sure everything is all right with your uncle? Oh, yes. He travels for work, always busy. I'm sure he just wrote it in a rush. Um, nothing to worry about. <laughs> right, it was nice to meet you. Thank you, Adelaide. Adelaide. Be seeing you. Of course. And good luck. Thanks. Is the new Hufflepuff out of bed yet? Professor Weasley's waiting for them outside the common room. Waiting for me? Professor Weasley? Yeah, um, if I tend to mumble on or I get, you know, I get lost in words, it's because I'm not very accustomed to talking and gaming at the same time. I used to live stream on Twitch, but recording is kind of like... For YouTube, it's a little bit different. Oh shit, what the fuck? That scared me. That actually scared me. <laughs> Alright, can't go upstairs. Well, fuck that stairs. What's over here? But, uh, that's a little different. Like, when you, when, when you record a session, you go back and you listen to it. Like, for me, I am my own worst critic. So I tend to be like, oh my gosh, you're rambling on too much. Or, or you don't know what you're saying. It is what it is. Professor Weasley. Good morning. I trust you're ready for your first day at Hogwarts? I've been dreaming of this day for a long time. Can't believe I'm here. Well, you are here. Make the most of it. You only have one first day at Hogwarts. Now, in light of your unique situation, joining us as a fifth year, you'll need to catch up with your classmates and not fall behind. Especially as you'll be expected to complete your OWLs at the end of the year. OWLs? Owls? Yes, your ordinary wizarding level exams. They will determine what type of career you can have when you leave here. 
After much discussion with the headmaster and the Department of Magical Education at the Ministry, we've devised something extraordinary to ensure your success. So basically like the SATs for wizards. What's this? What is it? It is a wizard's field guide. It will help you to keep track of what you are learning so that you master all that's expected of a fifth year. You would be wise to take full advantage of this exceptionally valuable resource. Thank you, Professor, but what do you mean it will keep track of what I'm learning? Perhaps seeing it in action will answer any questions you may have. Walk with me and we shall put it to the test. Alright. Let's go, Professor. I'm with you. This game do look great though. This way. I was literally the on guide Facebook will give you somebody's... opportunities to practice your magic and educate yourself about wizarding law. My bad guys. I certainly would have appreciated something like the field guide when I was a student. Using the guide will also train you to be alert to your surroundings. Do keep up. I'm trying. I'm trying to talk to the people too. So anyways, somebody on Facebook was telling me that the PC port wasn't, was kind of buggy and all that stuff, but I haven't really seen an issue. Simply on cast Revelio on it, and we'll see what the guide says. Revelio. Okay. Collect the guide page. So... Rumored to contain some Helga Hufflepuff's original creation. This book holds a collection of Hogwarts students' favorite recipe over the century. Some dishes like pickled, uh, I'm gonna say dairy gibble plums, are likely an acquired taste. I'm, I'm assuming that's what it's called. So you just unlocked the field guide challenge. Your progression uh, towards completing challenge appears here. Okay. So collect field guide passes in Hogwarts. Okay, field guides could only are uh, the only way to acquire experience points or XP. All right, it's good to know. This is your wizarding level XP earned challenge to increase your level and power. Oh, okay, your field guide tracks your challenge progress. Select the challenges menu to continue. Okay, so what's my challenge? All right, collect your first page, unlock a new challenge category, new challenge you unlock throughout your adventure will be here. Select field guide pages, okay. All right, each challenge has tiers. Special reward unlocked at each tier you complete from appearance to critical upgrade. Hmm, reward must be claimed from the challenge menu. Come back often to collect your reward. Good to know. Clever, isn't it? <laughs> Keep your eyes open for more opportunities like that, inside and outside of the castle. Rebellio. All right. Thank you, Professor Weasley. You the woman. I'm following you. Ooh, I saw something. What is that? I see it. Let's see what's this. Roll? All right, let's roll. What the fuck's that dude? Ah. Good timing. Perfect opportunity to show you how to use flu flames to get around a bit quicker. Your field guide contains a map of the castle. Open it up and find Central Hall. My field guide? You discover flu, uh, flu flames. Wow, that, why is that hard to say? It's just two words. Um, you can open the map at any time to fast travel to dis discover flu flames. Okay. To dis okay. Hogwarts is divided into two main areas. The left side of the map is where the student and the professor live, and includes the house common room and the great halls. All right, so I'm over here. So I'm in the great hall. In this view, you can see the flu flames available in that region. Green flu flame represent the flames you discovered, including your own house common room. Gray flame is revealed undiscovered. All right. 
On the right side of the map is where you find academic point of interest, including the astronomy tower, library, and crane house. Oh boy. Check that. Professor Lee has unlocked the central hall flu flame for you. Use A, D to rotate the map. Oh, okay. And. Oh. Shit. Alright. Yeah, guys. Uh, it's, it's really bad. I don't know how to, like, entertain you with. And here we are. Fuck. Quite the time saver. These stairs lead directly to Central Hall. I'm trying not to talk when they have dialogue. That's why I always like. You can get almost anywhere in the castle quickly from Central Hall. That's why I try to cut my commentary. So the dialogue is. Oh, there's something happening here. It's the heart of the hive. Our King's Cross Station, so to speak. That should be all for now. You'll be expected to attend both Charms and Defense Against the Dark Arts classes today. And I'd like to be sure you get to Hogsmeade as soon as possible to replace the supplies you lost on the way here. I lost supplies? Um, supplies? I don't even know what supplies I had. Can you tell me more about the Charms class? What will I learn in Charms class? Exactly what you might expect. Spells, charms, jinxes, all terribly useful. I think you will enjoy Professor Ronan. Oh, He's yeah. a clever and entertaining wizard and a talented teacher. What is exactly Defense Against the Dark Arts? We all Can know. Can you tell me more about the we Defense Against the Dark Arts class? Defense Against the Dark Arts, as the name implies, focuses on how to defend oneself against the evils that lurk beyond these walls. A mastery of Defense Against the Dark Arts is required for those who aspire to become Auras. Horrors. Fortunately, we are lucky Horrors. to have the ever-gifted Professor Hecate in charge Hecate. of our students' education in that regard. All right. Uh, what's Hogsmeade? I know what Hogsmeade you is. You mentioned Hogsmeade, Professor. Hogsmeade is the only all-wizarding village in Britain and is home to an array of shops and pubs. You should be able to find all of the school supplies you require in Hogsmeade. You will also, I imagine, enjoy many a butterbeer there with friends in due course. Mm. Thank you, Professor Weasley. A lot to absorb on your first day, and you have much to learn. Happily, your professors have agreed to create additional assignments for you outside of class. You'll be up to speed in no time. Judging by your adept use of Revelio earlier, I'd say Professor Fig succeeded in at least showing you the basics. He did, Professor. He's been terribly vague as to the events preceding your arrival, specifically about what happened after that awful dragon attack. My suspicion is that there's more to the story than a search for belongings and an extended trip up to the castle. Uh... I'm gonna be honest, there is... We did take a bit of a detour on the way here. Ended up exploring some ruins and... I shouldn't say more. Exploring ruins? Well, I presume Professor Fig has his reasons for keeping the details to himself for now. Speak of the devil, Professor Fig. Your ears must have been burning. Oh? Yes. You seem to have provided our new fifth year with a solid foundation in the basics of spellcasting. Ah, I'm afraid I can't take all the credit there, Professor. They've a rare aptitude for magic, it seems. Hmm. Well, I'm just glad you both arrived in one piece. Perfectly good boats and carriages to Hogwarts, and you chose to fly in the path of a dragon. <laughs> I wouldn't say I chose the dragon's path, Professor. Rather unfortunately, it would seem that it chose us. Very well. Enough chit-chat. I need to get to class myself. Might I rely on you, Professor Fig, to explain the details of the field guide's map? Of course. Thank you. Good luck today, and remember to use your field guide. It will be invaluable to you, and invaluable to me, as I'll be using it to keep up to date on your progress. Yes, Professor. Come and find me in my classroom after you've attended both classes today, and I'll explain more about those assignments I mentioned. And we'll see if we can't get you to Hogsmeade for those supplies. She's overly nice. I like that. Alright. Rebellion. Rebellion. What's else around here? Huh? Nothing? 
Just fig. Let's go. It's good to see you, Professor. And you. I was hoping our paths would cross today before you immersed yourself in studies. Did I hear you and Professor Weasley talking about exploring ruins? Mm. I hope I didn't say too much. I'm she be caught me off guard. I didn't tell her anything else about our travels here. I will say, I think she suspects we're not being entirely forthcoming. Yes, well, Professor Weasley is a brilliant and astute witch. It was right to keep the details to yourself for now. We don't know where this path we've embarked upon will lead. It may require a bit more flexibility with your time than she would approve of. And she may feel obliged to share details with the headmaster that would be better left between us. Understood, Professor. Good. Now, as capable as you are, I believe the ability you possess obliges you to be well-trained. Happily, you have the benefit of an exceptionally skilled team of witches and wizards to guide you. Speaking of guides, and so that I may avoid another not-so-subtle reproof from Professor Weasley, why don't I show you the clever enchantment we included in the field guides map? Unfold it and have a look. Okay. So, open the map. This... Whatever icon that is, represent main quest. Complete the main quest will further the story, unlock new features, and grant XP. Oh, okay, okay. Some quests are locked by spells and slash or slash. I don't even know why I say slash. Level requirements. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm not ready yet. Hold on, hold on, hold on, fam. In these cases, you will need to require a level and or have the required spell to act. Okay. This spell can be earned by completing a professor's assignment or quest reward. Okay. That's good to know. Track a quest with uh, the right. So I'm assuming this one is to get famous show Professor Ronan class in astronomy. Famous show how to do that. Ronan. Uh, uh, Levioso. I want to learn Levioso. Reward is. Yeah, I want to learn Levioso. I want to learn this. I want a lot of fucking... Okay, so you right-click it. The map is enchanted to help you find your way. This will be incredibly helpful. Thank you. Now, sounds like you've quite a day ahead. What with classes and a trip to Hogsmeade for supplies, including your own wand. Yes. You'll enjoy Mr. Ollivander. He's an exceptional craftsman and a good friend. I shall reach out when I have more information about our mysterious locket. For now, focus on your classes and pay attention. More than your owls may hinge on the magic you are able to master within these walls. All right. So this is my map. Can I like zoom in to see where I need to go? Okay. So if I'm in that room, just walk. It's gonna guide me anyways. Uh, so we got what? Challenges. Collectibles. Oh, what did I get? What did I get right here? Oh, yeah, yeah, that's right. That's right. I got a recipe. It's my inventory. I ain't got shit. My gear. Doug Life, yo. Um. Yeah, I'm good. I guess I just follow my quest. Phil Gap Show, Professor C's. Wow, there's just so much going on. Everything just like popped up all at once. We'll lead you to. Okay. So if I press this, it tells me where to go? I, I'm not understanding. Oh, I see it. I see the line. Open door! Oh, shit. Ooh, this is cool. I thought my dog was behind me. Oh, the courtyard. Let's go. Oh, what's over here? What's over here? Flu oh, flames. Nice to see you, my young friend. All right, let's go in here. So I'm going to the uh, tend to defense against the dark arts class. Cause that's what I'm doing, man. Where's Professor Snape's? Oh. Oh. Oh, it's 
Does it seem laggy? Oh, it's lagging on my stream. Uh, am I recording? Why is that? Professor Hackett! Perhaps you'd be good enough to blast each other to pieces in your own time. I get new students every year, but I only have one Hebridean black skull. I apologize. It was a token from My the recording great just... of 1878. No doubt you've heard of it. Okay. Now, you may be asking yourself how an old woman like me single-handedly took out the largest poacher ring in Eastern Wales and lived to boast about it. Knowledge. To the wise, age matters very little. Today, we will review a spell that has saved me from death at the hands of dark wizards more times than I care to remember. Levioso. Levioso? A levitation charm? Levioso! A surprised opponent is a weak opponent. Care to defend yourself, Master Pruitt? No? One thing I've learned as an unspeakable is the value of simplicity, especially in the heat of battle. Now, Let's practice what we've just learned, starting with something small. Yeah, I apologize for that recording. I I, I, I was watching the cutscene and all that stuff. I look over, I'm like, oh shit, it's, it's skipping around. All right, uh, let's do this. Levioso. Give me another spell. Levioso. It's not Levioso. Now, it's, let's uh, try something a little larger. Remember that? Oh. Oh, it's a key bind of two. Let us begin with a basic cast. All right, so what do I do? Basic. Mm. Okay. See how the dummy deflected your cast. This time, cast Levioso first, then the basic cast. All right. Remember, Levioso. good. Now, well done. Levioso. 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 Am I good? Very good. But the best way to practice is by dueling. Oh, you're going we'll down. We'll start with you two. Duelist, take oh, your marks. Oh, about fuck you up, Slytherin. Now, <laughs> I want a fair duel using only Levioso, basic cast, and, and Protego. Protego. You may begin. Okay, I know Protego. Levioso. This could be easy. Protego. Protego. Complicated stones. Your I'll beat your ass. Let's just say I'm a quick learner. I do enjoy lively duel. Yeah, let's go. Let's go, boy. Beat your ass. Use the basic cost when your opponent's guard is down. Not bad for a beginner. You give as good as you get. <laughs> His name is Sebastian's. I'm gonna assume it's Salo, but I read it real quickly. I, I put think you it says on the swallow. spot, <laughs> and you rose to the challenge. Points to Hufflepuff. Thank you, Professor Haggis. Glad to have the opportunity to practice. If what I've seen today is any indication, we can expect great things from you. I demand excellence from my students. <laughs> they are capable of achieving it, and they must achieve it. A classroom duel is one thing, but battling dark wizards, or as ever more likely, goblins, is a different kettle of Grindelows entirely. Understood, Professor. So, I'd advise you to keep practicing whenever you can. Perhaps Mr. Sallow will have some ideas for you. Again, well done today. I shall reach out soon with additional assignments. Wait, I get more work for All being... right. That's enough spectacle for one day. Class is dismissed. Ooh, Sebastian ain't happy with me, fam. 
Yeah, again, I do apologize for that little hiccup with the recording. I think, well, I just upgraded my computer. I put new uh, CPU and graphic card and all that stuff in there. So I have everything on Max. Even my recording's on Max. Everything's on Max on the same PC. And uh, maybe I should just pipe it down a little bit. We'll see. All right, Sebastian. Nice work. Sallow. It's not Swallow, it's Sallow. I enjoyed that. Well, that duel was quite something. Everyone will be talking about it. It was certainly good practice. Practice? It felt more like I was dueling an expert. Sebastian Sallow, by the way. Didn't expect a new student to be so deft with a wand. Then again, perhaps this wasn't your first duel. It's awfully kind of nice for a Slytherin. I'm not saying all Slytherins are bad, it's just... From watching the movie, man, they seem to be jerks. Um, I hide my share of wand combat. It was never used my wand in it. Oh, okay, I've jeweled enough. Consider yourself lucky I held back. Ooh, well, I'm huh. smack. Fair enough. You owe me an honest jewel when you aren't. You know, you might be a perfect fit for a certain exclusive, unsanctioned dueling organization. That does. That's mad sus, bro. Sounds suspicious. Unsanctioned? I don't know. School rules are in place for a reason. Yes. To keep students in the dark. So many things we're deemed unprepared to know. If you want to get the most out of your time at Hogwarts, you're going to need to break the rules now and then. Whether it's joining a secret dueling club, or sneaking into the restricted section of the library, you just have to be clever enough not to get caught. Thank you, Sebastian. I'll keep that in mind. Good. Pleasure chatting with you. I'm sure I'll see you soon. Perhaps somewhere unsanctioned? We'll see if your performance today was sheer luck or actual skill. Look for Luke and Brattleby near the clock tower entrance. If you're interested. I'm assuming it's a side mission. Till next time. Hmm. Dark. Defense against the dark arts. Okay. Everything's happening so fast. Revelio. Revelio. I didn't see anything interesting. Can I talk to this person? Can I? I'd hate to face Professor Hecate in a duel. Okay, I can talk. What is this? Yo. Revelio. All right. Let's see what else we got going on here. Alright, available Cyclops was found inside the region of a mark as a black flag and discovered by Explorations War. It's crushed for XP, but do not defend but do not advance the main story. Ooh, we want it. So it's right here. So the south wing of Hogwarts. Right? Is that where I'm supposed to go? Oh across well, I speak to about the dueling. Okay, okay, okay. So that's the way the dueling is. But that's not what I want to do right now, I guess. We'll go back. Charm class. Alright, we're gonna do the charm class next, but give me a second. I really need to go to the bathroom. Mm, alright, 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 guys. I'm back, I'm back, I'm back, I'm back. Let's go to our charm class uh, as our next main mission. I'm assuming that's our next mission. Yeah, yeah, that is. Alright, let's do this. Let's get out of here. All right, so we'll go out these doors. What was that? What was it B? Okay, okay, there you go. So it shows me the path of where I'm supposed to go. Yeah, this game looks amazing. Yeah, I have all my like uh, my game settings in max settings. My recordings in max settings. And like I just mentioned, um, having to see that little hiccup was kind of kind of weird. But uh, maybe maybe I gotta I gotta turn down some settings. Yep, yep. Actually, OBS is literally telling me to turn it down right now. Well, that's kind of a bummer. Well, I guess you guys gotta deal with a little bit of studying until uh, it clears up. I don't know what the issue is. Maybe I could change my uh, my own settings. I don't know. Like like the game settings. Maybe that will help. But after the charm, charm class. I'm sorry, guys. Professor Ronan tends to go on a bit. We sometimes but have to remind. See how this looks. It looks good on my end. Here, behind 
find you. There is an open seat here. Oh, thank you. Uh, how nice of you. Hello, I am Nettie. So you are the new student. Have you met Professor Ronan yet? <clears throat> Shall we begin? <laughs> Welcome to year five of charms. Now, this will be a crucial year in your education on the art of charm work, but I am confident that we will take hold with a passion and rigor requisite of such a challenge. Right, now, everyone, please open your textbooks to page 517. But before we begin, can anyone here tell me the difference between the incantations of the color change and growth charms? Anyone? Anyone? Hmm? Ah, 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 ah. I am afraid it is too late to study now. Hmm. My, the summer months must have really taken a toll on you all. <laughs> By the looks of it, you all spent your holidays practicing obliviate on one another. <laughs> uh, hmm. Do you even remember how to perform a basic summoning charm? Well, it seems that we are in dire need of review. Everyone get into pairs and take positions on opposite sides oh of the classroom. Now let's put those textbooks to use as the blunt objects you so believe they are and take turns summoning them out of one another's hands. Only one book will be needed per partnership, Miss Dale. Thank you. Get into place now. So what am I doing? Again, I apologize for the bad recording. I just don't understand what the hell is going on. So what am I doing here? How you, how you say that? Akio? Akio. Akio. That is not bad. You are a swift learner. I see a lot of potential, but remember, potential is nothing without practice. Keep at it. You might just rival Miss Onai here. Very good, everyone. <laughs> That's enough of that. What? What did you well, say? As you all seem to have the basics down, and it is an exceptionally lovely day, I was thinking that we might have ourselves a little excursion outside for a spot of fresh air. After me. Oh, was it lagging again? I'm sorry, guys. All right, all right. Well, on the next recording, again, I'm still learning this whole YouTube thing and to setting my settings. This is the first time I'm actually using all the settings, so hopefully it turns out a little better. I've always found my next that one. fun goes hand in hand with mastery, as well, I'm sure me, the Quidditch please. players amongst us would agree. Hmm? <laughs> so, what better than a bit of sport to put our prowess with the summoning charm to the test, right? <laughs> <laughs> so why don't we have our newest students start us off? Hmm? Wait, what am I doing? <laughs> Professor Ron, what am I doing? Very simply, cast Akio on one of the spheres and relinquish your charm at the last possible moment. Now, uh, think of this like gobstones, if you will. But instead of throwing the marbles out, you are summoning them toward you. Akia, the thing is to pull the sphere. That's it! Don't lose your composure! Oh, damn it! Crap. Alright. Very good! Happens to the best of us. Wait, wait, how do, do I have to stop it? Oh, I thought it was control there. I see. I thought I had to let it go. I wasn't sure. Very good. Points to Hufflepuff. But there's certainly no up. sport in playing without some friendly competition. Miss Onai, would you care to give our new student a bit of a challenge? Come on up. You did challenge me? You'll be the blues just as before. And Miss Onai, you are playing red. Clear? Yes, uh, sir. So what are you supposed to do? Oh, are we taking turns? I... Here we go! Oh, 
Oh. That is how it's done. Oh snap, she ain't fucking around. Akio. Neither am I. Let's go. That's it. Let us see this. Oh, you Gryffindor. Oh, wow. She, <laughs> dude, she's too good. I actually got lucky. I don't know. <laughs> well, shit. Ah, I'm really am getting lucky. Brilliant. Watch this. Please fuck up, please fuck up, please fuck up. Oh, here's my chance. Here's my chance. There we go. Here's my chance to be a hero. A perfect score. You ain't got nothing on me, lady. The perfect score. Summoner's Court winner. I'm a wiener. Let's make this a bit more interesting, shall we? What now? What now, Professor? Ooh. <laughs> I think we are well past interesting at this point. What you got going on I'll now? I'll say. Hey, enough chatter. Focus now. You will need it. This round settles it all. Be sharp. Hit it, hit it, hit it, hit it. Oh, this is gonna be hard, actually. That is how it's done. All right. Akio. Oh. Stay focused. My bad. My bad. My bad. My bad, Professor. Here we go. Oh, she's gonna whoop me. She's gonna whoop my ass. Oh, did my camera freeze? Yes. Oh my god. Yes. OBS is getting all fucked up. Hold on a second, guys. All right, we're back in the game. I'm sorry about that, guys. Uh, my computer is being all weird. There's a lot of fine tuning that Not I need exactly to do. Not exactly your typical lesson. But... This is Akio. But I work on it a little bit later. I want just want to get this recording down. Very good. There you go. There you go. Game on. Game on. Let us see this. Ooh. Yes, this is my chance. Can I beat her? No, I won't beat her on this. Oh, I can't beat her on this. Ready? One, two, three. Oh, yes, I did beat her. Quite impressive. Let's go. I thought I was going to lose that one. I'm really having some weird computer problems, but it's not the game. It's, it's my Very recording Very good, both setup. of you. Well done. Okay, what happened now? What? Class is dismissed. Gather your things on the way out. <laughs> Gather your things to get the fuck out. Good game back there. I must admit, I think I underestimated you. Took me weeks to become proficient with Akio. Took weeks for me to get anything right when I transferred here. It gets easier, I promise. That's nice of her. That's good to hear. It's a lot to take in all at once. To put it lightly, I remember how I felt when I first arrived. I transferred here from Wagadu just before my fourth year. My mother received an offer to teach divination here. Before I knew it, we had left Uganda and were halfway around the world at a new school in a new country. Wow. Is Wagadu much bigger than Hogwarts? <laughs> Wagadu School of Magic is the largest wizarding school in the world. So yes, bigger than Hogwarts. But it never seemed intimidating or overwhelming to me. It always felt like home. Is Wagadu a castle like Hogwarts? Its address is Mountains of the Moon. It is not so much a castle as a beautiful edifice carved out of the mountainside. I remember the first time I saw it, the mist was so thick I could hardly make out anything at all. And then it just materialized before me, this enormous school that seemed to be floating in midair. 
Is the magic the same as? This may seem an odd uh, question, but is magic the same there as it is here? Mm, mostly, yes. But I did have to learn how to use a wand when I arrived here. Hardly anyone at Wagadu uses one. That's interesting. You can cast spells without a wand. Oh, yes. I find wandless magic to be much more instinctive. Not to mention quite convenient if one is without their wand. Yeah, I was gonna say. I must admit, however, that I am growing quite fond of using a wand. It seems very dramatic. Yo, my characters be meeting awesome characters. It's nice to learn about another wizarding a school. Slytherin, Thank you for asking. A Gryffindor. I do miss Wagadu, but I am glad to be here at Hogwarts. Ah, I think Professor Ronan wants to talk to you. Better not keep him waiting. Until next time. On Dragon Ball Z. Of course. What the you fuck can you use Akio oh, well, well, if, if, if you're so inclined. All right, what do you want, man? Well, you, you wanted to speak clothing, with me, Professor. I did. You know I trust your work. first charms lesson lived up to expectation? Well, an outdoor competition wasn't exactly the lesson I was expecting, sir. What charm is there in the expected? You did well, managing to best as gifted a student as Miss Onai. Thank you, Professor. I enjoyed the match. Miss Onai is always a fierce competitor, though I sense that she is a bit distracted of late. <clears throat> now, Professor Weasley has asked that your professors give you instruction outside of the ordinary curriculum. Expect to hear from me soon regarding a special assignment that I am preparing for you. More freaking homework? Oh. Revelio. So, there's an icon on the map here. Uh, I don't know what it is. So what, what what am I doing now? What's what's my what's my main mission? Okay, let's let's check my uh, inventory. My quest. My quest says. Oh, I don't even know what. Okay, what's this? Class one. You should pick. Oh, yeah, let's do this. Let's track that one. I'm all bought. Let's go. Hello there. You're Hello. the new student, aren't you? Samantha Dale. Yeah, I'll talk to you. What's Hello. Up? You wanted to speak to me. Samantha Dale. I've been eager to meet you. You're the student everyone's been whispering about. Hope your first day is going well. You certainly seem to hold your own in charms. Uh, I was kind of you say it wasn't too. Okay, here you go. <laughs> I've been fortunate. Beginner's luck. <laughs> My brother William would tell you not to be so humble and to trust your abilities. Then again, he tends to be overconfident in his. Well, better see to my charms homework. I'm afraid I can't count on beginner's luck to impress Professor Ronan. So I've basically met like uh, one person in every uh, house. What's up here? There's so much places to go to. Ooh, is that is that what I'm thinking? You can't of? imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented flu powder. In the so how do I? And by the end of it. How do I enable this? How do I enable the flame? I'm assuming it is. Okay, it's green, so I guess that works out. Yeah, on, on, on the next uh, episode of Jan's Hogwarts Adventure, I'll, I'll do better with the settings. I do apologize with all the lag stuff. I like, it's like, as you can tell, it's really like bothering me that it happened. On, on the right side, my game. On the game side of my my end, it was fine. I think it's just my recording. So, whoa, did I think just move? It did move. Like my gameplay is perfectly fine. Wait, how do I do? I forgot what it is. Is it is it T? Oh, this is my spells. Wow, there's so many different spells. I forgot how to show that guide. Oh, there you go. That's a guide. I was like, I don't remember what it was. Ooh, now we're outside. Try not to move my mouse so much too fast. Here you go. Okay. Sorry, I'm not really smooth with the mouse movement. I'm trying to be all like... Try to create the atmosphere for you guys, but... <laughs> 
my mouse sensitivity is so high. Uh, it's just kind of like my uh, you know, PC player style. Give me back. Oh. Revelio. What's this? Oh, click that. I'll click that. Unless dire uh, straight, it's probably best to avoid this particular toilet as it's alleged one of P's favorite pranking spot. Oh, that, is that P's right there? Here I've come from the toilet bowl where she said I could swim. Did you practice your mole? As long as we're only one time per week, I can plunge the boy's lavatory. Not for the meek. Please, Peeves, you'll make me late. That is Peeves. He tried to stop me, did rancorous carp, sought to trap me, confine me inside of a jar. But he failed, as did his containment charms, so I took my revenge to wreak havoc and harm. It was granted my privileges, be handsome indeed, or I'd fire up the cannon, and so she agreed. To draw up a contract with her, not with him, that if I behaved, I'd have one weekly swim. Wee! I'll get you for this. Damn, Peeves, leave that kid alone. <laughs> Nothing worse than human. What a dickhole. Anyway, I'm gonna go duel some people. Side mission time. So we've done two main mission. We're doing a side mission. We have more main mission, but it's a mystery right now. So we're just gonna explore. Oh, look at the arena for Quidditch. Is there a Quidditch in this game, though? Like, in general? Like, at some point? Will I be able, able to play it? Truly, I don't know. Lupin's just over there. What do you say? Revelio. Let's see what this first is. What is this? So, oh, here you go. Handy resource indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. What am I doing here? I'm talking to this. Can I help you? Oh, I thought I talked to this guy? Okay. Sebastian told me to see you about a club. If Sebastian vouches for you, that's all I need to know. Oh, I coordinate duels for crossed ones. A dueling club of sorts. It's invitation only, so you must have really impressed Sebastian. Uh I did take him down a peg. Oh, nice to hear. I'm flattered to hear that. I'm trying to be humble, you know. Sebastian's not a bad duelist either. Imagine it's quite something to see the two of you duel. How does Cross Wands work exactly? You show up, I match you with other duelists, and whoever is still standing in the end wins. It's our way of determining the school's greatest duelist once and for all. And to liven things up, the winner is awarded a prize. Interested? Yeah, let's go. I'll join your club, let's go. Of course. Dueling's an entertaining pastime. I agree. Besides, in Cross Ones, you could duel with a partner if you like. Your first time I'll pair you with Sebastian. Next time, you'll need to bring a partner along or duel alone. So, care to step into the ring? Oh, let's go. Is this WWE? Get me in the ring. Spectacular. Let the fireworks begin. Am I... So, I paired up with Sebastian or am I fighting Sebastian? We'll make you regret signing up. Astoria Cricket? Okay. Okay, so, so, break through yellow shield with control spell, like, uh, levitation spell. Okay, it's like, levioso. Uh, target like a sp lets you track enemy without aiming. Use left right to target while, okay. So what is that, cap locks? Really? Oh, damn it. I didn't do it. You're better than that! Oh shit. Sorry, F. Okay. I'm sorry, I'm still learning. But it's actually a lot harder than I thought. I don't know who's aiming me. I, I'm, like, I'm like, I don't want to die. It's actually pretty hard. Now that you're in battle. Oh, 
shield. Oh, that's not Levioso. I did Accio. I did Accio the whole time. Oh, this is actually uh, a little funky. It's my first battle. Nice work. Sebastian wasn't wrong about you. There's strong competition ahead, but keep this up and you could be the next school champion. Brilliant. Count me in. I shall. Now, it takes time to organize these duels, but check with me later. I may have something lined up for you. Again, congratulations on your first Crossed Ones victory. Well fought. Dude, I almost lost. Hope to see you back here again. I literally almost lost. That was tough. That was that was quite tough. I uh I think I guess I'm still comprehending the fighting in this game. It took me a minute. Um I yeah, that was that was that was a little tough. I won't lie, I won't lie. But uh, I got through it. What is this? So, gear superior award, legendary glove, complete two main stories. Okay, so I got that. What's this? Wait for me. What's this right here? Complete. Okay, I got complete main glove. Okay, so challenges. So we got the map. Oh, we got a main mission right now. What's this? What's in here? After class, Professor Weasley. So let's. How do you fast travel to this? Uh oh. Did I do it? Did I mess up? Maybe? I don't know. I don't know. I got it. I got it. I got it. Oh, I'm currently not tracking anything, so let's uh let's track something then. Yeah, let's try it. Professor Weasley's mission. Alright. And then you hit one of those and it tells me where to go. Alright, cool. You certainly sound like you have an opinion on this. Man, I've been using the wrong spell the whole time. Alright, what you got for me, Professor Weasley? <gasps> Is that What Dobby? about the room, oh, Professor? Deke? I was thinking the same thing, Deke. Perhaps you could help. Oh, uh, excuse, Deke. Ah, there you are. I trust your first classes went well? They did, Professor. I heard as much from Professors Hecate and Ronan. Seems Professor Fig taught you quite a bit during your brief detour near... What was it you said? Some ruins? I'd wager there's a good deal more to your travels here than what you've told me. Isn't there? Yo, hasn't Professor Fig said anything? Have you and Professor Fig not discussed my training? He continues to be reticent about the details. Mentioning only a few spells. Revelio, was it? And Lumos. Lumos? That's correct, Professor. I see. Like trying to get a sonnet from a streeler. Regardless, you must continue to build upon what you've learned. In that regard, I've asked your professors to help hasten your progress with some extra assignments. Yeah, Professor Ronan did mention it. Professor Ronan did mention something about that. In fact, Professor Ronan will meet you outside momentarily to assign your first one. Now, regarding the trip to Hogsmeade I mentioned earlier, we've arranged to replace the supplies lost on your way here including seeds, potion recipes, and spell crafts. Thank you, Professor. And Mr. Ollivander will connect you with the perfect wand. Yeah! You've managed your classes well with a borrowed wand, but you'll find the magic you cast with your own wand to be far superior. I wonder if, like, a wand is, you know how, uh, in, like, games like The Witcher where you use certain level of uh, swords and whatnot, and the better the wand, I don't know, excuse me. I really don't know what I'm talking about. I figure like in, in, in Harry Potter, you get assigned one wand and one wand in. You don't need to like keep buying new wands to upgrade your ability. You just upgrade, you know, just work on your skills, but I don't know. All right, what can you tell you more about the potion shop? 
Can you tell me more about the potions shop, Professor? J. Pippin's potions stocks a wide array of potions ingredients, although they rarely sell recipes. Professor Sharp asked that they have a couple of particular recipes on hand for you. Okay, okay. What is spellcraft? I've never heard of a spellcraft before, Professor. What is it? A spellcraft is a recipe of sorts used when conjuring objects. I shall explain more about them when you begin working with transfiguration magic. Hmm. So are they really... So there really is an Ollivander here. There's an Ollivander's in Hogsmeade. There is. Most people are familiar with the shop in Diagon Alley. We're fortunate to have someone like him nearby. Mr. Ollivander is a genuine craftsman and highly skilled wand maker. I would trust no one else to pair me with a wand. All right, I'm ready to go then. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. Very well. I'd like you to make your first visit to the village with a classmate. Help you get your bearings. Perhaps Sebastian Sallow or Natsai Onai. I've noticed you spending time with them. Ooh. I get to pick a classmate. Do I want to chill out with a Slytherin or a Gryffindor? I am a Hufflepuff. We don't really like Gryffindor. No, I'm not Gryffindor, uh, Slytherin people, but Sebastian was kind of cool. Uh, I mean, he did help me with the whole, uh, the dueling, the fighting that we just did. Ah, uh, you know what? I'll chill out with a Slytherin. Let's go. I'd like to go with Sebastian. Glad to hear it. Mr. Sallow is a capable young wizard, and he knows the area. He'll keep you well clear of any of Victor Rookwood's undesirables en route. Rookwood? A rather unsavory local. Best to avoid him and his associates, including his right hand of sorts, Theophilus Harlow, if you can. Once you've finished Professor Ronan's assignment, your friend will meet you at the castle doors. No time to waste. The sooner you complete your work, the sooner you can enjoy a butterbeer at the Three Broomsticks. Um, Rookwood was one of... I was going to speak about some additional assignment. Yeah, Rookwood was actually one of the two uh, character at the beginning that were... Uh, that were talking about how seeing ancient magic. Rookwood was talking to... Uh, oh my gosh, I can't think of the other person's name. Um, but you guys know what I'm talking about. In, in part one, where he went to go... Uh, uh, set up the route into that room, and then he... Oh my gosh, I'm, I feel dumb right now. I can't. I can't even think of the person's name. Anyways, I'm, I'm, I'm babbling on. Let's continue. Speak to Professor Rowan to receive your first assignment. Assignments are a type of quest given to you by Hogwarts Professor. That when completed, reward you with new spell. The rewards for completing your spell assignment will uh, be the mending charm, Reparo, which will require to complete other quests. You can track assignment. Okay, cool. I get Reparo. Reparo. Rebellio. But you guys know what I'm talking about from part one when I was, uh, maybe, maybe not. I don't know. I'm going to talk it out of my ass. Out of my ass. All right. So the quest is, welcome to Hotsmeet, Professor Rowan. We need to go find this guy, right? All right. We already tracking it. All right. So where is it? You know what? It's right here. Oh, it's not far. I'm right here. Okay. It's not far. Nope, sorry. Uh, it is. Yeah, I've so always it. said that travel broadens the mind. Yeah, Rookwood. Oh, there he is. He's just chilling around. Playing with fucking birds. What are you doing? Let me help you. Let me help you out, bro. Ah, there you are. Oh, it's stuttering again. I'm so sorry, guys. Encoder's not keeping up with this. You have a new spell to teach me, Professor. Indeed I do, and an exceedingly useful one at that. The Mending Charm, Reparo. Fixes things right up, makes a broken object good as new in the blink of an eye. Hmm. It seems as if that might come in handy. More frequently than one would imagine. As Professor Weasley mentioned, I am not the only one who will be teaching you spells outside of class in an effort to catch you up with your peers. A number of your professors have agreed to do so as well, but first, each shall ask that you complete a few preliminary tasks to hone your magic. I have arranged some for today, 
See them through and then report back to me. We will have you casting Rapero in no time. Alright, what is the purpose of the test? Why must I first complete tasks to learn Rapero? No lesson or lecture can compare to first-hand experience, and these tasks should provide you with just that. Such experience is invaluable when mastering any new bit of magic. Alright, I'll complete the test then. I'll start on the task right away, Professor. Alright, so Professor Ron gave me some assignment to complete and then he will teach me Reparo, the Mending Charm. Collect flying pages near the broken statue, collect flying pages near the fence against the Dark Arts Tower. Alright, so how do I collect them? Like... Alright, let's, uh, let's go to one, I guess. Oh, here you go. This is the right area. I wonder where the flying pages. Yeah, I see it. I don't know how to... How do I get it? Maybe I'll pull it towards me? Accio. Oh! I had to use Accio. Okay. See? Now, it's making you think. You gotta use certain spell. Okay, I got one. It's forcing you to, like, use and learn all your spell. Get, get in the habit of doing... A flying page must be around here somewhere. Using them. Here you go. Accio! Brilliant. Easy. I gotta report back to me. That was quite uh, easy and brief. I trust the preliminary tasks. I completed the assignments, Professor. Marvelous. You clearly know your way around basic charms. It's Let us give the old again. mending charm a try then, shall we? Remember to be deliberate in your enunciation and movements. I want to see some vigor. Now, wand at the ready. Yes, sir. Mm. Remember. Your wand is a conduit of your magic. Ooh, there's an F in there. Hold on a second. Let's go, boy. Oh, no, it's gonna get me. Oh, it's gonna get me. Oh, it's gonna get me. Oh, repair. Oh, hey, what am I repairing, though? Many times could be a bit of like that okay that's it very good if you would like to practice mending something have a go with that broken statue in the alcove by the water it allegedly symbolized heartbreak perhaps a jilted lover thought it too accurate and lashed out wait where is it lumos all right there rebellion He's talking about that right so I'm gonna repair this shit? Repair it. Nicely done. Works like a charm, doesn't it? Hmm. <laughs> okay. That's how we do this. That's how we do. I, I'm really, I am enjoying this. I, I, again, <laughs> I think I'm a, I'm a perfectionist. I just don't want you guys to have a shitty recording coming from my end, especially when I'm trying to sh share you my adventure. But, uh, oh, visit Hogby and gather your spot. So that's where I'm going, Hogby. Uh, but, uh, you know, I, I, I tend to be really, like, nitpicky about stuff. What do I do here with the levels? So I'm just level three. That's it. What's this? I have exclamation mark. I got quest. I got something, right? Okay. Working towards it. What's this? Page. Okay. Nice. And I, 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 like I said, I, I tend to, to be, get caught up in uh, something like that because, even though it's quite simple fix, which I will do in the next episode, I just think about it way too much. All right, let's not look at the item. Let's go to our next objective. There's no nothing being tracked. Come on, I thought I tracked something. I thought I was tracking something. So we're gonna go outside. All right, right. Can I track that? Is that not gonna let me track it? No, 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 go back. How do I, okay, I zoom in. And, oh, here you go. There you go. How do I track that? Why can't I track it? Oh, what is this? Oh, that's Hog, Hogsmeade. 
Okay. Interesting. I'm not, I'm, I'm having a hard time why I can't uh, why I can't, I can't select this. Maybe I'll do this. So, oh, I had to hit right right click right click full waypoint. Guys, still learning. All right, still learning. Still learning. All right. All right. Tell me the way. Show me the way. Oh, it's this way. Revelia. Ooh, I see something over here. What's over here? I don't know what the fuck that is. Reveal? What am I looking at? Ooh, ooh, ooh. How did I pull it in? How did I pull it in? Pull it. Ah, here you go. Come here. I see you, Paige. I see you. You get over here now. I just saw you. Where are you? Uh. Gangster. Okay, what am I looking at here? Uh... I truly don't know what I'm looking at here. Revelio. Is this a puzzle that I'm supposed to figure out? That I'm not figuring out right now? Oh, how about this? No? This might be a spoiler for some of you guys who plan to play this game. Ooh, these paintings are moving. Maybe you guys give me a clue? Guys, give me a clue? No? Um... I truly don't know what I'm looking at. Uh, should I try it all? <laughs> I'm gonna keep doing this until it works. Is that what I'm supposed to do? I I I, I think that's what I'm supposed to do. Ooh, that's not. Yeah, I have no idea. No idea. Fuck it. I'll come back for it later. I don't want to spend too much time on that. Rebellion. Oh. Aren't they including it? Okay. Ooh, what's over here? All of the shops. There's something in there. I just know it. Lenora. Side mission? You know, I'll talk to you in a bit. I gotta be a mission to catch up with. All right, I need to go to Hogsmeat. Let me finish Hogsmeat. Let me get to Hogsmeat, and then I'm gonna end this video. And then uh, maybe later on, work on a new one. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. I still am working the night shift at the moment, so it's kind of rough. I should be going to bed soon. But I'm gonna try to edit this real quick, have it rendering, and load it up. Sebastian. Well. Fancy meeting you here. Dude, you're taking me to fucking Hogsmeade, man. Hello, Sebastian. Ah, my new charge. I'm told you're in dire need of supplies, and I'm to accompany you into Hogsmeade for them. Is this your first foray into the village? Well, yes. It is. I haven't left the castle since I arrived. Well, I shall endeavor to be the very best of guides, then. Hogsmeade's a charming little place. Self-contained, too. We should be able to find you everything that you need. Shall we? We shall. Did it? Did it? Like, you know, I can't even tell anymore. <laughs> I'm getting too caught up with this. Let's say part two of Jan's Hogwarts adventure is a leggy adventure. All right. But we're leaving the castle. Let's see what's going on. Do I get to find my broom? Do I have a broom? I was glad Professor Weasley asked me to join you today. As am I. Thank you, by the way. Of course. You're the only one who's ever bested me in a duel. The way I see it, I'd be wise to keep an eye on you. Speaking of Weasley, she seems to have taken quite a shine to you. Has she? That's nice to hear. I'm still surprised that a professor would entrust me with anything, given my detention record. I spend a lot of time in detention, do you? 
Just enough to keep me well rounded. That's the Slytherin way, you know. See, I Speaking wouldn't know. of detention, this oh. trip to Hogsmeade might have saved Rebellion. me. Anyone. Glad I could be of service. Madam Scribner, the librarian, was on the hunt for me, as is often the case. Professor Weasley came to retrieve me, and I was able to convince old Scribner that I had somewhere to be. So how did you manage to get on the librarian's bad side? Well, I suspect it's a matter of differing opinions. She thinks I shouldn't be allowed in the restricted section, and I, on the other hand, am inclined to disagree. Oh, just one moment. This is an excellent spot to gather lacewing flies. They're pretty to look at, and if you stew them long enough, they make a powerful potion ingredient. Revelio, Accio. Am I supposed to, like, pick some up? Oh, I am. All right, cool. Thanks, Sebastian. I guess I'm still training, you know? Game looks... You know what? I want to walk. Merlin's Can I walk? from the Forbidden Forest. Look! What's going on? See for yourself. Quite a sight, isn't it? It's beautiful. You certainly don't see that every day. This game is awesome. I think Poppy's already seen the hippogriffs. Absolutely. Likely already made. I mean, to the left is the oh. Forbidden Forest. Out of bounds to all students. Oh, hence the name. Precisely. They think it's too dangerous. I think they need to have more confidence in our defensive abilities. Ah, you can see Hogsmeade just past those ruins up ahead. You can see Hogwarts Castle. Beautiful. Right there. Alright, where's Have you had much of a chance to explore the castle? No. A little. It's positively enormous. It is that. I've been there five years and barely scratched the surface. Loads to see, places to discover. Oh? Any you'd like to share with the class? Perhaps one day. Rebellion. I can't go around telling you all my secrets now, can I? You still haven't told me how you became so good at dueling. I'm not gonna tell you either, Sebastian. That's my secret. I don't need you to be a better wizard than I am. I've always thought Thestral's pulling a carriage a bit grim. Though I suppose most people don't actually see them at all. But you can see them. Unfortunately. But you've seen quite a bit yourself firsthand too. Most notably that dragon attack. Hopefully the rest of your year isn't as eventful. Oh, that's awesome. Hold on. Hold on, Sebastian. You can wait. We'll check this out. So dope. All right, Kitty, I saw you. I hope it's not like a human that's transmog. Oh. And there's a bunch of guys just chilling here, eating a snack. All right, Sebastian, I got you. I got you. I'm following you. Let's go. Where are we going, man? You're taking me for a long ass walk. Mr. Moon, he's the Hogwarts caretaker. Looks a bit worse for wear. Huh? Hello, Mr. Moon. Have you met our new fifth year? Pleasure. Uh, you might want to turn back, Mr. Sallow. Uh, turn and run. Is everything all right, sir? Oh, it looked right at me. Eyes big as saucers. What did, Mr. Moon? Huh? Demi guys. Ugly and airy and terrifying. I shall be at the castle where it's safe. Good luck to both of you. Wait, what? A Demi, guys. I don't know what he's putting in his pumpkin juice, but he's obviously had too much of it. I've never seen Mr. Moon in such a state. Oh, what? Mr. Moon is quite the character. My sister Anne thinks he's lovely, but I'd say he could improve a bit as a caretaker. Oh, is your sister in Slytherin too? She is. Or rather, she was. She's not well at the moment, but she'll be better soon and back at Hogwarts. Ooh, Hogsmeade. Yo, okay, so where, where's this in comparison to the castle? Castle's right there. Oh, that's so dope. Let's go. Oh, man. How exciting. Honestly, if one could bottle the magic of this place, 
I don't know if it's the shops or the people, but there's just something about Hogsmeade. We all flock to it like moths to a flame. I love it already. All right, give me a moment to stop, and I'm gonna end my recording. Again, my 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 OBS so how would you is like to do this? Hard time Weasley told me he had a list of things to get, a wand and some other bits. Yes, Dittany seeds, some spell crafts, and some potion recipes. Perfect. Can't wait to see what you do with the new wand. And a short list gives you plenty of time to poke around the village. I just have to pop into a shop to find something for my sister. Let's meet up in the town circle when you're finished. All right. Remember, have fun. It's Hogsmeade. Hogsmeade Village is a uh, is a brimming with different sites, shops, and other points of interest that you can navigate through your field guide. Okay. All right. It's Hogsmeade. Point of interest. Let's see. That's good to know. All right, I'm actually going to end my recording now because I feel like it's. I've been playing for a little bit, a little, a little over an hour and a half, and another problem that I'm having is the recording. I, I don't. I truly don't understand why OBS is acting this way. It's, it does have some uh, encoding issues, but it's not that bad. It, Yes, the game's on max, and yes, my recording's on like the best quality ever. Maybe I gotta like turn down my recording quality a little bit, uh, or maybe the game quality. I, I really don't know. No, I'm not turning down the game quality. But overall, I think one thing that might be an issue is the RTX that I enable in this. Um, but I think for part three, it's gonna be a little better recording. Learning experience for me, trial and error. I'm no pro. Clearly, I haven't been doing this for a while. Uh, I try to make videos on and off, but. I just never fully commit, but this time around with this game, I really do want to make a long series about it. So I'm super excited. Um, thank you for sticking by me, even though this is crap right now, a crappy video. And uh, I promise you, next video is going to be better. And we're going to check out Hogsmeade in the next one, gather all the supplies, and really just explore Hogsmeade a little more, because I still don't know how to get my way around other than the waypoints. Um, I got to be a little more fluent with the dueling, so I'm hoping I get a, a, another opportunity at that. But uh, we'll see how things go. As of now, uh, Sebastian is our homie at the moment, and we haven't really got really close with anybody else in our uh, house. So, anyways, thank you for joining me. This is Jan's Hogsworth Adventure, and I'll catch you guys on the next one.